to my channel consider subscribing if you haven't done that already so this video is a continuation of the first video you can see the link up there that's the first a continuation of that video and in this video we're going to learn how to add images to our puzzle okay so we're going to learn how to add images to our puzzle pieces like what we have here and then we'll add some more to it okay so this is um, from the last video this is from the last video and we're just going to learn how to add puzzle pieces to 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 this uh, um how to add images to this puzzle pieces so i'm just going to duplicate this slide and then we will go on with that so i'm taking this out i'm going to delete this so this is what i have left this is what i have left and um so i'm going to add images to this all i have to do is go to insert pictures and then go to my pictures so this is um i have this pictures i'm going to be using this picture and i will click on it and click on insert so here it is as you can see it's bigger than this so i'm just going to reduce reduce it but before reducing it you can see it has white background so what do i do to take this out all i have to do is come over here to where i have remove background okay under format remove background and i'm just going to um select okay i'm going to select the area that i want to keep you can see this purple area needs to come back so i'm going to come up here and click on mark areas to keep and i'm going to select here and that's it so the background is gone as you can see okay so it's that simple to learn how to take out the background of your images using powerpoint check the link in my description you're going to learn how to do that i have a video on that in my channel okay so i reduce this okay i can work with this let's work with this so i'm going to reduce this so this is one and I'm going to control D that's to duplicate okay and I have two here okay so you can decide to also add a text to it you can decide to add a text so I have here I'm going to have cards here okay so make it bold, increase the font size a bit, okay, and here we are, okay, you can also decide to change the color of the text, go up there to text, um, fill and take out the color, change the color to white, depending on um, what you are working with. The color you are working with okay so i'm just going to duplicate it and move it over here and then i'm going to have car okay so this is done so what do i need to do now i'm just going to click on the puzzle piece hold my control key down and select all the other ones up here okay every other um detail i have in here i'm going to select them then right click and i'm going to group so it's one now okay and like i showed you in the previous video you can go further to um cards right click and paste it as a picture and you're done so do the same thing with this and group ctrl g cut and paste as picture and we're done with this All right now next i'm going to insert something new okay I'm going to insert something else in there okay i'm picking this dress all right so just take out the background like we did with the first one take out the background and 
we're good to go so all i'm going to do right now is to reduce the size okay so i'm reducing the size of this and i'm going to make it two or more since it's singular and plural okay and then one over here good so i'm just going to go and insert my text box right now so i can have um dresses Increase the font size. Okay, and then over here I do the same thing. Centralize it. Okay, so this is it. I do the same thing. Pick everything group them cut and paste as pictures do the same thing here ctrl g cut and paste as picture okay so i can come over here right now to my rotate and um, turn it around right you can move it around move the pieces around and um we're done with this so your students will have to move this around and fix the puzzle pieces okay so this is one way you can add images to your puzzle pieces just by doing this all right so go give it a try remember to subscribe to this channel if you haven't done so already and like this video leave a comment below and i'll respond to it I'll see you in the next video where I'm going to show you how to um, use images also with your puzzle pieces.